All right, we're to day 12 on Jenny's countdown to Christmas, so let's see what's in the bag. Okay, so there were some more great guesses yesterday in the comments on the video. One was that I remember was for washi tape and one was for the marking tape, like when you're doing diagonal sewing that is used on the sewing machine. Both really great guesses. So let's see what we got. Whatever it is comes with an instruction video, I see. So diagonal seam tape. So I cannot remember the name. I'm so sorry of the person who guessed that, but you are correct. I've never used it for before, cluck cluck, so that's cute. So it says there's a video for it, so I'll have to check it out and look and see. And then I can um, do a video that shows how it's used and let you guys know what my thoughts are on it. Sounds like a good idea, because this would really, that sounds really helpful, really. If it's what I think it is and what I've seen, um, Jenny using on some of her tutorial videos, it'd really come in handy and save a lot of time from marking corner to corner and sewing when you're doing half square triangles and things like that. So I'm excited. Okay. So, um, yesterday was that cute little thread ornament. I still have it in the box, but let me grab it out here. If you remember, um, I looked on the website and they had one, I think it was in red that I saw in there and it was $12.95. So I went down, went ahead and wrote down that it was um, $13 just to make the running total of math easier. Besides, there's going to be tax and stuff on it. So I think that I can be forgiven on that. So that brought the total of the box up to $109.50. So we're doing pretty good so far on getting our value out of this purchase. And... Let's take a look at number 13. So when I was getting this out, I was pretty sure that there is a pen or something here. And oh no, this is like the spiral bind. So it's definitely like a, I'm gonna guess it's a notebook or one of those um, sewing journals that I've seen on their site before, like where you can, write down, um, you know, the different quilts you're working on or plan to work on or patterns you want, different things like that. I'm going to guess that's what 13 is. So if it is, it's exciting because I really, I really, really need to get more organized in the new year. I have a plan for redoing my sewing room here and trying to get it nicer and uh, uh, more organized so I can work in a better environment. So I plan to do a video on that, like a vlog type thing showing what I'm purchasing for my sewing room and redoing it. And this would be really nice to get all the projects I want to do organized if it is a journal. If it's just a notebook, I can always use those too. But that journal type thing for um, planning out what you wanna work on and when you finish quilts as a kind of memory would be really nice. So, I'm excited to see what tomorrow is. I hope you guys tune back in. Let me know if you've used that diagonal seam tape before and what you think of it. I'd love to hear about it. And as always, I hope you guys are having a wonderful holiday season and I look forward to seeing you here tomorrow. Bye, take care you guys.